Four Wisconsin cities along Lake Michigan are trying to preserve a piece of forgotten history. Shipwrecks dating back to the 1800s lie beneath the surface, and now they hope to make a national marine sanctuary. NBC 26's Raquel Lamel is live at 5 with the details. Hi, Raquel. Megan, this area runs more than 800 square miles just off the coast, spanning from Port Washington to two rivers. And now historians are hoping to get national recognition for the area. Michael Retzinger knows what lies beneath these waters and how important a marine sanctuary is to the history of his community. The Great Lakes, Lake Michigan is a great lake and I think it's, a, it's well worth preserving. Historians understand the designation will help attract new visitors to Wisconsin's lakeshore. This can be an economic engine for the region, attracting tourists from around the world to if not dive on the wrecks, to learn about them virtually through video feeds. Four cities, Manitowoc, Two Rivers, Sheboygan, and Port Washington, applying to the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Association, or NOAA, for the sanctuary. We're hoping to have the application done by this autumn. Then NOAA determines whether to grant the request. That could take some time. This two or three year process has to involve the public. Public support matters because the request will not be granted without community backing. It's a move Redsinger says he's all for. It's all history. That's, I think it's important to preserve it. Well, there are 12 shipwrecks located in the proposed area. Tonight at 6, we'll explore the history of those vessels and what caused them to sink. Raquel Lamel, NBC 26.